Good evening. Now, this is day five. Here we are on day five. Everything, they've picked up all the rubbish and everything is now done. Right, amazing. This is how it looks. This is how the heat pump at the front of our property looks. So thank you very much to Octopus Energy and the lads and Steve who was leading them. We, they were all awesome, really, really good. You know, everything went swimmingly well and I kept, they kept me updated all the way what was happening on the day and any challenges they were facing and everything. So really, really thankful to that. And this is the final result. They've picked up all the rubbish and here we are. This is the final result. So there is no gas anymore in there, in the brown case there. There is not, nothing in there. It's empty. The gas meter has been taken away and electrics all done, neatly pulled together there at the bottom. Everything, it's on. Although it's not on now because all the settings, the heat is all good at the minute. And there we are, where it says, it's giving me the sticker as well. This is the four kilowatt hour heat pump. And yeah, it's, it, it's a big unit for the size as they say, but they, as, they always say there's no difference between the, the four, the six, and the nine so yeah so all the cabling sorry about the wind all the cabling is all done the gap between there it's about half a meter between the wall and the itself we could have brought it back a bit more but yeah we will see how time goes but yeah the cabling was done there as you can see this is the end result it goes up there and we will see how it looks as time goes on. We might have a cover of some sort there. So everything is complete on day five. It's been commissioned. There we go. So inside, there we are. As I said, it's not running at the minute because it's set to be uh, to run if it comes down to 18 degrees so it's it's now it's 20 degrees in here it's working with the weather compensator at the back so the heat pump is at the front compensator is at the back because the sun shines at the front and you have to be careful not to use those um, degrees because it's not the true reflection so we use the back compensator there and where the boiler was they've tied it up and everything there just need to paint myself on there all covered up nicely and because i've got no gas anymore i changed to a induction hob which i've used yesterday and it does do what it says it's mark these words it's unbelievably quick cooking on here it's really really amazing really good cooking on there excited about that now going upstairs to where the engine of everything is bit of lighting more lighting so here we are everything has been done commissioning the paperwork is up there i've kept it up there and the unit is there trunking nicely done on there and everything is set asked all the right questions on there the meter for uh, the pressure is there and the pipe is here to change if i need to change it or to update anything on there the unit is here shows everything and it's saying outside is 20 degrees the floor has come down right to the bottom where it's set at 25 and the maximum at 50. And the inside temperature is showing 21 and the water is 39. It's set to, to come on. The schedule is for 
one o'clock in the morning where I'll be using less energy through my intelligence uh, go uh, tariff that I'm on. So yeah, it has given us an opportunity as well to tidy up this area. So we are all good, happy, comfortable, and looking forward to learning more on how we get on with the heat pump and I'll keep updating on the usage. Before I finish, please do like the video and I'll now show you the decking up that I have as well. It's all set there. It's meant to be 18 degrees, so it's not coming on because as you saw, it's showing 21 there and that's where we are it's set to be at 18 so that's why it's not coming on the app itself the water is at 39 there you go you can see the 39 also at 39 on there and if i want to boost the water i can just press this button and when it reaches 43 degrees it will come off so this is quite good then you can also see the inside of what the kiln what it's using and as you can see i've used nine kilowatts an hour nine kilowatt hour in two days in april it's showing month by month so in april i've just used so it's been on for two days the heat pump shows you the air quality as well on there which is very nice of them with pollen none uh, the heating has used four the water tank has used five so that's good the app itself is straightforward really then on here i found something on the app where it says integration you can integrate it with alexa or the google assistant then you can also do it with these apps i tried using the intelligent octopus app there but it doesn't work it's not going through so maybe in due time it might appear on the octopus app as well and you can clearly see what your heat pump is doing so yeah really really thankful to octopus energy and greg on a job well done so now it's a matter of now getting used to using the heat pump and how it operates everything straightforward if i'm turning it off i can just turn off there i don't really need to because everything is set so yeah thank you thank you very much thank you very much for watching and following through these videos you know from day one to up to day five now so really really grateful and do share and like this video and subscribe to the channel where i'll be talking more on the use of this heat pump i've got um, a good window at the minute where we're in summer and the most important part is in the winter where we'll see how we get on with it. So thank you to Octopus. Thank you to Steve and the, and the lads. So I've just come back outside just to show that the actual unit is working at the minute. So we will just turn on the heater, the, the water for a bit because it's showing 39 degrees at the minute. So we'll just turn it on from the app. I've just turned it on there where it's red. You know, then we'll see it kick on in a minute or so it will start going if it needs to so we will wait and see when it starts there we go there we go i don't know if you can see that i don't know if you can hear that either as well so this is the it's not noisy at all when it gets to 43 it will cut out so yeah as you can see the app works as well so exciting one last time the kid in a candy store right i'm back again so as i turned it on earlier when the water tank was uh, at 39 degrees I've just gone to do the school run and I'm back now and I've just looked when I arrived at home and as you can see it's now off it's not 
on at the minute and the up is showing the water tank to be at 49 degrees now so that emission heater is off now and that's it really that was quick and i can actually even check i can clearly check now as well in the inside how much that has used it has not moved folks absolutely not moved at all still saying nine kilowatt hours used five for the water and four for the climate so yeah so far so far so good